back in my day, we didn't have all your fancy match three, didn't explode puzzle games. We had Marble Drop. Hi, ah, it's Flip with Let's Play Marble Drop. Um, as I said, this is an old game. <laughs> uh, I used to play it when I uh, had Roller Coaster Tycoon on my old computer way back in the day. This was like, I think this game was came out in 97. So yeah, it's pretty old. Uh, and it's a simple puzzle game that, that I haven't ever seen done again, like this type of game. Uh, now everything's just like, oh, we're going to do Bejeweled and all that kind of stuff. Anyways, the, the goal of the game, you drop marbles in here, they go along the track, and then they eventually will end up in one of these little bucket things. And you need to fill up all the buckets with the correct color marbles. So, for instance, we put a yellow one in there, and increase the speed because it's slow. Then, if everything goes according to plan, bam! Right there in the, uh, in where it's supposed to go. Uh, so once you get all of them, then you're good. Uh, you get points for doing stuff, so like every time I trigger one of these little trap things, I get 25 points. Points are up here. And you use points to buy more marbles, in case you mess up. Uh, these little flappy things just slow down the ball and give you five points. Obviously these cups just take the marble up and throw it into the thing. Um, so now, uh, also when you go over these green things, they have this little trap door effect. So now when I put a marble in here, it'll go through this trap door. Uh, which will go over here to red, so we're going to put a red one in there. And this one goes to blue, so we'll put a blue one in there. Um, and then there's also these trapdoors, so if I put one in there, it'll go down here to blue, and this one will go down here to red, so we need to go ahead and do red and blue again. And then, if you see this, they go to red and blue again, so we'll do another red and blue. I've done this level quite a lot, because I've tried to record this three separate times now, and it's failed every single time. So yeah, now we're good. Now I can do yellow again, because everything's back to reset, and it'll go into the yellow thing. And finally, a red and a blue. And this level's done! Yeah, the sound effects in this game are really cool too. I really enjoy them. Especially the pendulums, which we'll see in a bit. Um, I'm not going to play this whole game. There's like 50 levels or something. And... I'm not actually too good at the game. <laughs> like, these first couple levels are pretty simple. Uh, so I'm only going to play the first five levels or so. And then, I mean, just, just to give you guys an idea of, of what this game was like. Of what gaming was before. In, in the before times. Uh, so now we have this new thingy, which is a target. Um, and it'll bounce back one marble when you put it in. So, for instance, if we put in one here, it would go do-do-do-do-do, and it would go in there. So we put in the green one, and it goes in there. But now it's stuck up, so now it will never move again. Uh, and if we put it in here, it'll be green again. So let's put a green one, then it'll be purple. So put a purple one, and it'll be green, and it'll be purple. And finally, it'll be green. Then over here, we have yellow. Just put in three more yellows into this one. Oh god! Shut up! Shut up! Sorry about that. Had an alarm on my phone, and then my phone exploded. Thank you, droid. <laughs> so we put in two more yellows, and then we put in a purple. Two more purples. Do do do. There. And that should be this level done. So yeah, as I said, these, these first levels are easy. Um, after the fifth level, I'll show you level six. Actually, because there's this fifth, level five is a secret level that I could never get to. Oh, you're going to yell at me, aren't you, phone? You're going to be like, no, uh, no service. Verizon Wireless. Loss of service. Yep. Verizon, Verizon wireless. wireless. Thank you, phone. Make this terrible. Um, why, 
why, why making that clicky sound? Okay, anyways, so uh, now we have this thing. That's that's the other cool thing is that they keep adding new stuff as it keeps going. So this is a three-way di uh, dive oh diverter okay three-way diverter. Yeah, yeah. If uh, in the background you can see it says what the different things do. Uh, for instance, uh, perpetual motion. It'll go through these loops. Um, so if I put one in here, it'll follow this left track and go down here and go to orange. So I'll put an orange one in there. This middle track will go to green, so we'll put a green one in there. And this right one will go down here, go through this loop, go down here, spin around twice, go all the way up here, go through these loops, loop, loop, and be stuck in an endless loop forever. Which means we lose a marble, so we're not going to put one in there. Uh, over here, we have to lose a marble, so we'll lose a, I don't know, red marble. Knocks that and falls back in. Now we can put a pink marble in there. It'll fall in, or pink or purple, or whatever you want to call that. Now if we put another one in here, it'll fall over here and go to green. So we can do that. Then we can put another purple one. And now the only way to get to orange is to have this switch. So we have to waste, essentially, another marble. So let's waste a, I don't know, an orange marble. And that's why they give you the points to buy more marbles. Clink, and we're done. But we won't get these marbles back. If you notice, we have five reds. We still only have five reds. Okay, level four. Which has another new thing, my favorite thing are these pendulums, because they just make the coolest sound. Um, also we have uh, this tumbler thing, which if you manage to unlock it, which I've never done, then you get the secret level, but I've never done that. So if I go in here, it'll go up this way, swing across, go down, go up, swing this way, go down, swing across, and go blue. So we put a blue one. be left over that way and we could put in an orange one. Can't do that yet though. Okay, we can do it now. Because the time timing matters. You can't just put in the correct series and then it'll work. You have to actually wait for the timing. Which is another thing this game did that was pretty cool. And orange. Okay, and now if I put one in here, it'll go whoop, trigger that, trigger that, go this way, and go to red. So we'll go to red. <coughs> and then we have to wait, and I think green will go in the next one. That way, that way, that way. So yeah. Wait for that one. Get this green one back before I mess up something terrible. Wait, we have seven? Oh, I guess we start with seven of each. I don't know. Okay, we can put the green one in here now. Yeah. This one's pretty simple. You just have to alternate putting in whatever the colors are. Shut up! I, I don't, oh god! Jesus! Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Okay, so now uh, we have yellow. We put a yellow one in there, and they're both yellow, so we can just do two yellows. Hopefully it won't destroy everything. That's gonna be annoying. Because <laughs> now that's gonna go in there. Oh, do we have. Oh, you can get a whole bunch of points in this level if you just do that, but. Eh, it's not worth it. Because it'll go down these things multiple times and stuff. Clink, 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 clink. And then here we can put in. 
It'll go that way, that way. It'll reset everything so it's a green one. Yeah. So it's green, and then red would be the next one. Some of these levels take a while, but I don't know. It's just it's cathartic or something. There's the the noise it makes, the clinkage. What do you say? But yeah, I hate I hate new puzzle games like um, Bejeweled and all that. They're just they're so boring. Oh my god, so boring. Um, so we should be able to put a red one in here and be fine. I hope. Let's hope. Unfortunately, I'm playing without the uh, sound on right now. To hopefully make the recording a bit better. <laughs> so there's no sound in the background. But there probably will still be stupid sounds in the background. Because I really need a new microphone. Um, which I hope to get eventually. Orange and... Okay. We should be able to put the blue one in... Right about... Now, should be good. Yep, should be good. So yeah, you're supposed to turn off all the lights, I guess, on this thing in order to activate it, but I've never been able to do it. Uh, I know it says in the background that the best um, thing you could do won't be the correct thing to do it. Uh, anyway, so this is the last level I'm going to actually play, and then we'll just skip ahead to one of the later levels and see all the new cool stuff. So this thing adds something new. It adds these um, marble holder things. These, what are they called? Holding tubes. Uh, and the holding tubes, they'll keep marbles in them until they're filled up, and then they'll activate, and then all the marbles will fall down at once. Uh, so we have, do this way, this way, this way, this way is a yellow. Let's put a yellow one in there. And this one is green, or red. Then this one will go this way. It'll go up, that'll be down, but that'll be up, so that means we need an orange. Yeah, when you don't get the correct color in, the marble will explode. Um, I don't know if you lose points or gain points by exploding marbles. I think you gain slight amounts of points. So, orange is correct there. And then here we have, we need blue, pink. Pink. Right? Yeah. Should be a pink one. And then we can go over here and get a green one, I guess. Mm, yeah. So put a blue one in there. And a green one. I said a green one in there. Go. Be free! Now if I put one in there, it'll go down there, which would be yellow. Right? No, I have to do it in this one. Yeah, I have to do it in there. Okay, and I'm going to have to waste the marble anyway, because um, this one I won't actually go until there's three, and there's two spaces left, so I still need one more in there. Um, so, what are we going to do? This one goes this way, goes this way, goes that way. So, yeah, it doesn't even matter. A blue one and a blue one. Oh, oh I thought there was going to be a collision. That would have been cool. 
these different marbles, the silver one, the first marble it touches, it'll take that marble's color. I think. Yeah, see, when, um, when one of these is full, this little saw blade comes up, and it'll kill any marble that comes that way. Because it hates them. It's like, die, marbles die. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, but yeah, these black marbles, uh, they'll fit in for any color marble, so it doesn't even matter what color the marble is. Um, so they're like wilds. And then the silvers, I believe, take the color of the first marble they hit. Um, okay, so what these things do is, uh, when you hit the switch, this blocker will go down or up, depending on if it's already down or up. Um, so, blue and orange. Uh, so if I put a blue one there and an orange one here... See, they... it worked. But now, this blue one's stuck in between those. Uh, so that's cool. Uh, anyways, I, I'm not gonna do this level. Um, let's go ahead and select another level. Let's select... I don't know, this one. Yeah, see, these are those... Um, special levels, the bonus ones that you have to actually do. Uh, so let's go ahead and do this level, see what the new stuff is. Oh my god, I don't know what this is. I have no idea what any of this is. <laughs> Apparently this is a marble generator. It'll generate a red marble. That's what it says. I have no idea what this is. Um, apparently it'll go here, then... I have no idea. Let's just let's make a black marble as we can. Drop in a black marble. <laughs> oh, we made a yellow marble there. That's cool. What is this? Merger. Let's make another black marble. <laughs> okay, what does this do? Oh, one over there. Why did it go over there? Alright, I gotta figure out what this stuff is. I don't actually know. I'm sure if you played it in order, it'd make more sense. Oh, I made another yellow marble. Oh. Okay, so it merged a black marble and a yellow marble. I have no idea. But yeah, it has all sorts of cool different new thingies going on. Let's let's try this one. This one has swirly barrel things. And waterfalls. Freezer. What does a freezer do? Let's find out. Oh, okay. So, it makes them hot or cold. Um, wow. <laughs> yeah, these these are, these are so so advanced compared to, like, Bejeweled and stuff. Sue Song. What is this? I have no idea. Uh, let's do that one. Or, I know, let's do the last level. This is the last level in the game. The hell. Oh, and these ones need silver and black ones. So let's drop in a black one. Oh my god. That just went away forever. That one went away forever too. Oh. I. We. Invisibles. That's really weird. Okay. Oh, and these things turn... Oh, whatever. Anyways, uh, so yeah, I just wanted to showcase this game and show you how fun it is and just how much different it is from the, the puzzle games we have today. Because I am... It's just so awesome. Just keep dropping marbles in. That's all you do. That's the only, That's the only thing What just happened? <laughs> That's the only choice you get to make in this game where. Oh! I got a point. <laughs> let's, let's pop out some silver ones. Let's put in some silver ones. I don't, I don't know what the silver ones do. Ooh. Okay, so yeah, this has been Let's Play Marvel Drop with me, Flip. Um, you you kids these days, and your marble games, and your, your YouTubes, and your dumb nuclear weapons. 
Uh, see you next time.